Okay, guys, let's see how we can install PHP and use Xdebug in order to debug code inside of WSL in Windows. Before doing anything else, I would like to go to extensions and here install WSL. So this extension, Microsoft, open any folder in the Windows subsystem for Linux. The next one is PHP debug. After it's also installed, we install the essential PHP debug with sudo apt install php xdebug and when this is ready now let's add the configuration of xdebug to our php interpreter with nano i'll edit etc php version then coi configuration and here we would like to grab xdebug.ini I've already placed those lines. Basically, you need to enable the extension xdebug, this uh, shared library, and to configure it with the following uh, two lines. When ready, we override the file. The next step is to load up our folder, which now is on our uh, Windows installation with the WSL remote extension. So I'll click on connect to WSL using this row, and I'll choose Ubuntu. I can open now the same folder. I have it already here, the location, it's under mount, C drive, users. So I'll reopen this folder. This is important because we actually installed everything inside of our Ubuntu WSL distribution. And now we are reopening our files from within Linux. And this will allow us to put breakpoints in order to increase the speed of compilation and debugging. It's also recommended that you should place your projects directly inside of the Ubuntu distribution. Okay, so let's place the breakpoint here in this ConnectDB. Okay, now let's go to run and debug. We'll go and create this launch JSON file. We'll have this configuration inside. Basically, we'll need to specify port 9003 for xdebug to listen for it. And we save this configuration. Afterwards, we can start our main server with xdebug session equals to one. And then this environmental variable serving the files from the current directory. Let's place one breakpoint and click on F5. We see that port 9003 is open and xdebug is using it. All right, so if I go to the browser and enter information, click on submit, this will hit our PHP file with post request. We see how it's not yet processed because the debugger has stopped it. Let's go to the editor and we see our breakpoint is uh, triggered. Basically, this means that xdebug works. We can skip some lines and we see that those local variables are being filled. So this will allow you to use uh, xdebug inside of Windows while using WSL for serving PHP files. All right, guys, thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to the channel.